Greetings one and all, this is Lloyd Brown and welcome social media family to my vlog. You know sometimes you're in the studio and there's nothing better than I like to do <laughs> than being here, cuddle up next to you because you, you, yes you love me baby just the way I want to be loved. With all my heart and with all my soul. Yay, hey, 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 hey. Feeling the love, <laughs> feeling the blessings. Will you please welcome, live and direct, inside my laboratory, the one and only Miss Paulette Taja. Come on. Mr. Lloyd Brown! I'm Lloyd. Lloyd Brown. Hello, Lloyd. Hello, Lloyd. Hello, Lloyd. So I've, I've made an anthem for you and it goes something like oh this. It God. goes... I love Pauletaja. Yes, me love Pauletaja. Yes, me love Paulette. Da 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 da. Yes, me love Pauletaja. Yes, I love Pauletaja. Yes, I love Paulette. Miss Pauletaja. Baby. Only one way. Stress. Oh, yes. Like Ron just oh. hanging me stress. Oh, you could not hear where we said. <laughs> I, I completely forgot. That is a good comeback. That's a good comeback. But first of all, may I may I apologize for, for murdering your, your song? <laughs> not in any way. It's a pleasure. Uh, and remember it's not my song, you know. I didn't use William's song. You know? That is true, but mm -hmm. I mean you've made you've made that song. You've made that song your own, you know, and you have you have a lot of similarities with with Denise. I must say, you know, she's wow, yeah, that's a real. No, no, I mean, in every way, you know, you're 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 very petite. Because when I met Denise, you mean short and small. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a, talk the truth, man. <laughs> I I I met Denise backstage on on one concert, and it was like I I literally just stood there with like, oh. because. She, I went to see her. You must have been backstage when I went to see her. Must have been. Yeah. Must have I was been. blown away. It was, do you know that's the first time I've seen her live? Yeah. After all these years. Because you know, you know she done backing vocals for Stevie Wonder when no she way. when she recorded the songs in the Key of Life album. Really? She was she was his backing wow. vocalist. Yeah, yeah. Wasn't, is it Sirita who was on that as well? Yes, that's yeah, right. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So humble. So humble. Wow. wow. Anyway, I need to get something off my chest before we even start, and we'll give the reason why this lovely lady is here today. <laughs> I've had this said to me, so I know what, I know what it feels like, but, mm. Paul, but Paulette, I've got to say, I had a massive crush on you, oh you know? Oh my God! <laughs> I had a massive... Embarrassing. No, no, I don't business. I had a massive, <laughs> massive, massive crush on you. Because, oh you, you know, the way you look and the way you sound, it was like, oh my gosh, she's got the whole package. <gasps> not that I'm not that I'm trying to body shame or anything like that, anybody, you know what I mean? Because I know we're living in PC times today, but you know, it's like when you mention Paulette Tarly, it's like just a, just a picture comes across and you're like, oh my gosh. Oh my god, I'm getting this is this is not even menopause, this is proper hot flush. You you can sing you can sing the ingredients <laughs> on a pack of corn flakes, and it's like oh I'm just overcome with emotions, you know what I'm saying? But anyway. <laughs> This is what we call the icebreaker, just just for her to, to feel, you know, just to feel welcome and nice. Yeah, and I'm feeling really hot now in the sense of temperature, not anything else. Okay, good, okay. good, good. As, <laughs> as long as we've got that clarified, because I don't want to be the cause of no divorce, settlement, all and thing there, you know what I mean? But anyway, could you tell the people in internet land, what is the reason for you? In fact, what are you doing in my yard? What are you doing in my yard? Well, okay, you want the clean version or the... Anyway, <laughs> just give your version. But you know what? Lloyd Brown has been someone that, and I'm not just saying it because he's here and he's let me into his home, but someone who I have admired in terms of his um, musical intellect. His songwriting is crazy off the hook. That's two pounds. Right? <laughs> two pounds. It deserves more than that. Okay. More than that. Okay. No, I'm talking about notes. Okay. 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 Right. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this man. You know, not only a prolific writer, artist, performer, but what he does for other people as well has mm. been just, you know, and I'm honoured to just be here in his presence. Mm. You know, Lloyd called me 
yes, let's say out of the blue because it wasn't a call I was expecting. Yeah. Um, and said that he had a track and that he felt that that we should maybe collaborate on that track. He's doing an album of collaborations, and I was like, what? And I did all the, you know, I'm not worthy stuff and whatever, and you know, I'm here today, and you know, all I can do is give the Almighty thanks because he pulls something out of nothing. You know, and I give him thanks every single day for life, for health, for peace. You know, we've all got our Absolutely. stories, we've all got our stuff going on in the background, you know, but music can often transcend all of these challenges we have in life, you know, and I use it as therapy. Same here, same here. Mm. And, you know, just just to be able to have a gift and to be able to share the gift is, is, is good for me, you know, and... Um, I was kind of surprised when we had the conversation talking about when when we both actually got started in the business. Cause yeah. I thought I thought you got started long before yeah, me. Yeah. But you carry it good, don't you? Listen, me look all, you know. <laughs> no, stop that. Right, me look all. Stop that. But I haven't been in the business as long as you think. Stop that. Yeah, I mean, I've been singing a long time in private. Right. In my little bedroom with my brush. Yeah, yeah. yeah but um, in terms of like professional music career, that didn't start until '83. 83 okay 83. So, so it was a year after me then yeah so we're not wow. that far apart at all wow you see you how know? you see how things work <laughs> she just makes it look good she just makes it look good and sound good and just basically carries for many years yeah. and you look 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 Stop. Stop. evidence is there i hope you got a filter on this carmina look at me you know with my papa smurf papa smurf beard and all these things i normally don't wear my beard on the week until the weekends <laughs> So we're cool today. Yeah, that's, 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 a, little bit too much, that's a little bit too much information <laughs> right there. But anyway, we're here to record a tune and it's called Turn Around. And, um, you know, I just thought, let me just run it by Paula and see what she's saying. You know what I mean? And, you know, what what what, what do you think of the track? It's very sensual. I only, it's very I, sensual. I, I, had to, I had to consult with my pastor just to make sure, you know, I wasn't crossing a line. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's been giving his blessing. Ah. And my daughter's giving it a blessing as well. Oh, she love it too. Mm, she love it, she okay. love it. Okay. So, um, so basically, I think from my perspective, it tells a really um, common yes. story about relationships. You know, whether I've heard it from friends or family or whatever, you know, the, the situation big argument yeah yeah nobody's talking to anyone yeah. silent treatment going on yeah yeah and then making up go to sleep making up and you know little tap on the shoulder <laughs> the best way to make up you know what i'm saying everything goes out the window as it were but anyway that's all we're gonna give you ladies and gentlemen boys and girls brothers and sisters for now i think we're giving you a little bit too much information right there too much. so I just want to say, Paula, thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank, thank you. you. And thank you thank for you. engaging in the project. Um, I mean, Michael, Michael's, Michael's taken up my whole camera space with the interview as well. So, and he's, it's been a blessing for him to, to come down and be a yeah. part of the collaboration album. And you're just the, you're just the cherry on the cake right about oh, now. Thank you so much. It's just great working with you guys. And, you know, um, long may the reggae, you know, family continue and multiply and keep this going man because absolutely it's much needed absolutely blessings king so it's with that i'm gonna bid you adia and as always you don't know the coup people please abstain from foolishness even if it's your own mm -hmm. deal with that even yeah. if me i bring your foolishness just dash me one side because mm -hmm. it's a mistake that we all have to basically learn mm -hmm. from at the end of the day so it's with that we're gonna bid you adia and until we link up next time Peace. Stay blessed with God. Sing a little something for them. Something, something, something. Anything, 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 <laughs> anything. I'm going to sing back to you then. All right then. There's nothing better that I like to do mm. than sitting here cuddled up next to you because you love me like brown. I don't like I don't like I don't like I don't like Just the way I want to be yeah, yeah. We're, we're gone. <laughs>